Right guys, this is a landscaping video. We are landscaping someone's garden. They want a football pitch. So who are we to say no? This is where soft landscaping skills come in to play. As you can see, the garden is full of different levels. We've got this level here, which runs round, which drops down into that level. And we've got this level here, which rolls into that. And we've got this knackered, tired old fence that runs all the way through the garden along here. And as you can see, the guys got going a bit lively. They couldn't wait for me. They were so excited in getting this fence down that they thought, right, let's just get started. They've started pulling it down already. And you can see they've started piling it up over here. Now, what we've got here is a very interesting situation. We've got a load of undergrowth, but the client in their home wants a retaining wall built down the entire length of the garden. We're gonna, we're gonna dig it all out. We're gonna dig some really deep footings. We're gonna get the concrete lorry in. We're gonna pour the footings and we're gonna let them set and then we're gonna build up block work. So again, we're gonna use um, hollow concrete blocks, which are gonna be filled with concrete um, and they're gonna produce a really strong ret retaining wall. We're gonna reinforce it with steel rods um, and this is gonna retain all of our soil. Then what we're gonna do is once our wall's built, we're gonna start landscaping this. We're gonna level out this entire garden. It's a sporty family, they love playing sports, and as you can see behind, we have got the football goal. So instead of breaking your ankle over this horrible existing lawn, they're gonna have a new, nice new surface, many hours of fun on a Sunday afternoon, kicking the ball around and uh, having a variety of games to play. So we're gonna get cracking with this, we're gonna get the fences down, we're gonna get rid of everything, we're gonna dig the footings, pour the concrete, get the blocks up, landscape it all put some nice quality topsoil some beautiful turf down we're going to compact everything and you are going to see the process through and uh you know something slightly different to the usual videos so let's get cracking footings uh, and the concrete has started to be poured and we are filling in the shuttered off footing area with concrete loads of it and then the reinforcement goes in and we put more concrete on top and this makes these footings really strong and stable uh, so there we are raking the concrete around leveling it off so this can set and uh, go solid ready for our block work to be installed We have excavated the garden, and as you can see, the garden is in piles. Uh, we have put our footings in, as you have just seen. So we got that poured, and we've got the footings all the way through here, which we have put some shutter in behind, uh, and they have set nice and solid. So we have got strong footings to walk on, and we are building with concrete H blocks. As you can see, this pipe here, we've got drainage pipes, so that um the water can escape we are going to be putting a lot of soil against this retaining wall um and obviously we don't want loads of water to sit there and then the wall would fall over which is not good um so the um the wheat poles large wheat poles we are going to put taran which is a permeable sheet we're going to cover that and then we're going to put some shingle and some larger stones aggregate 
so that um, the water can drain properly. And as you can see, we have constructed the wall down here um, and we are building it up. There's reinforcement in it. And then we are gonna get leveling this soil so what we've got going on top of this wall is we've got angle irons. We have got a mesh metal fencing. So this mesh metal fencing is uh, going to be put across. It's three foot high so that the client can still see this beautiful view from the rear of their property uh, where they are going to be walking their dogs and, uh, you know, probably spending many a sunny morning looking out onto this. Um, so we're gonna put our angle irons, we're gonna concrete infill the wall, so that's solid concrete. Uh, the angle irons are gonna get set in, then we're gonna put a, a block pavia along the edge as an edge detail, which is gonna be set higher, so then we can soil up to it. Uh, and then the turf's gonna go up to that, um, and it'll be a nice mowing strip. Um, and then we're gonna start turfing this. So we're gonna get on with the progress, get cracking with this job, and you're gonna see the fun that we're gonna have. So we've broken up the old concrete base that was there. We're going to use it for some backfill, for some drainage um, down the back of the wall. And as you can see, the guys are constructing the block wall there, which is a, a solid H-block concrete wall, which has been infilled with concrete, and they have put the blocks on top. At this point, the garden's still looking a bit of a bomb site. We've got piles of earth everywhere, but as you'll see, things will start coming together um fairly quickly and it's just all part of the process um so the wall there nicely constructed we've got the posts in for the fence as well so that they can apply the uh, the mesh fencing uh, to those posts So the turf has turned up. Yeah, please subscribe to our channel. It really helps with these videos. Really appreciates it. And everyone who has subscribed to the channel. So the topsoils have turned up. That's all arrived. Um, and we've put some sheeting down to get the topsoil on. It's a bit of a wet day, so it's a bit messy, but we will clean up thoroughly afterwards. Um, and as you can see, we've uh, we've leveled the ground. We've taken out all of the the concrete and all the uh, the bad bits into those piles of dirt that we had there, and and sort of graded it out and refined it. We've got our metal uh, mesh fencing. That's all in, nice and tight, um, and all straight. Uh, and we're getting the topsoil after landscaping those levels and leveling everything about. Uh, we are starting to get a nice layer of thick topsoil um onto the um the soil areas so that we can uh, get prepared ready for laying the turf which is outside and as you can see with these projects how it's gone very quickly from a complete and utter mess to uh, something which looks a bit more peaceful and tranquil um, as i think you'll agree this fencing is nice and straight and tight really good line on that um, and we're getting a really nice level on this um, this new lawn as well. So as you can see, the turf started going down. We've got boards there, raked out the topsoil, got levels, got straight edges out, um, and we started laying nice long strips of turf uh, that were well bonded, ready to tamp it all down, compact it all, flatten it all out, uh, and it's going to give a nice new beautiful green lawn as you see here. Look at that looks absolutely fantastic a million miles away from uh, the images that you saw um, a video <laughs> um, a couple of minutes ago lovely new lawn so guys the job is finished and we are just in the process of cleaning everything up with the jet wash, so if you come over here and have a look at this fantastic new lawn that we have installed, we have cleaned all around here, cleaned all this paving off properly for the clients, we've installed this fantastic head to the back, we've installed some of this turf, it's a bit wet still, so uh, yeah, it is a fantastic new lawn for the client to enjoy for many years to come so if you like what you see please 
like and subscribe to the channel uh, if you like the project please let us know what you think in the comments really appreciate the comments um, and yeah please subscribe to the channel it really helps us with content uh, this has been a, a really good project uh, and showing off our hard and soft landscaping skills and construction skills in building this massive retaining wall all the way through and then obviously putting this perfect fence with a beautiful line across the top um, and, and, and creating a nice level enough lawn so the client can uh, play sports and enjoy the garden um, and enjoy their home more, more so. So thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video. Take care.